there was a moment where I decided I wanted to try doing shoes, mm -hmm. but I felt like it would be best to do a collaboration um, with an expert. At that dinner, where you with Naomi and I was in that table, <laughs> this is a long time, and I saw that movement of that marvelous neck. <laughs> that he told me, me this story. I, I That's so funny. This, story. this is the truth. <laughs> I thought his spirit was so sweet and bright and bubbly and fun, and he is so passionate about shoes. He loves shoes, and the thing that I love most about you is when you talk about shoes. When you even come up with an idea, when we were just brainstorming, sure. every time you liked something, I knew when it was right because you would say, ooh, 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 ooh. and then you would just get back to the sketch, back to the sketch. You're so animated, and I love that. I cannot fake it. <laughs> What if we did, you know, use your tat you tattoo as a design for the embellishment? I want everything that I do to be done in, in a way where it's credible and authentic. Mm -hmm. He is the shoe king. How many Welcome pairs of his do you think you own? That is disgusting. Don't ask. <laughs> Can you imagine the privilege of really uh, an old boy like me working with a child uh, so talented and beautiful like you are? Come on, there's nothing forced about this collaboration. It's just been one of the things I do in life is spontaneous. I never do think about interest or whatever. This just like happened. Cheers to British Bell! <laughs>